I thought about this circuit for some time, how to make a transistor tester or actually more important, determine what kind of junction transistor you have and also identify the three leads. And what I came up with was using a bipolar diode and what this is is just two diodes in one package one red diode and one green diode and when you run current in one direction it'll light up red and if you reverse the direction it'll light up green and notice that one lead is longer than the other Here's the wiring diagram and on the green or red green diode notice that I have labeled which lead is the long lead and you can see it's a simple circuit I use a 12 volt AC transformer and a few resistors two of those bipolar diodes, red-green diodes. And here's a look at the transformer that I'm using. And here's the setup. And here are the instructions for using this circuit. Now I've got the diagram and these instructions uploaded to my server. And I've got the link to the server in the show more of this video. So let's demo the circuit and then we can see how it works. Okay, I've got power on and I'm just gonna pick up a transistor. I've got three leads here and I'm just going to start somewhere and well, across it we got green ah, that's what we're looking for red green okay now what that means is when the configuration is like this we have black and yellow or it could be reversed and we got red green that means that these two leads are E and B I don't know which is which yet but what that means is this lead here is C and the yellow goes on C Okay, now got a 50-50 chance here. I'm just going to go in the center. We got green there. We also got green here. So what that means is this is a NPN transistor. Now I'm going to get the green lead. That's for the base. And touch it right here. Nothing happens. So Put that over here like that and now touch the center okay that's the base we got red green here so that means that this is E B and C and it is a NPN transistor oh there's one more thing I want to do I want to use the red lead here Okay, much less bias, but it still changes red green, so it's a fairly good gain transistor. Okay, pick up another one. I got a few laying around, I don't know which is which. Okay. 
Okay, red, red. Okay, we're looking for red green. There's a red green. And we'll have red green here too. So that means that these two leads here are emitter base. Again, I don't know which one, but that means that this one is collector. Again, we got a 50 50 chance. I'll just go with this one. Oh, this one's green also, so this is an NPN also. Yep. There's the base in the center. So C, B, E again. So I happen to pick up two NPN transistors. And with the red lead, it changes, so it's a fairly good gain transistor. Okay, here's another one. Again, we just start somewhere with the black and yellow lead. Red, red. Okay. Red green. Okay. Of course, this will be red green again. Yep. Okay, so these two are E and B. This that makes this C. So now that's red. So this is a P N P transistor. Okay. That in the center, get our green lead. Nothing. Okay, got our red green there in the center. So that means that this is C, B, and E. Get our red lead here. Oh, and it changes a little bit, so it's a fairly good gain transistor. Okay, now here's a power transistor. And I do remember that this is C. and But I don't remember which is E and B here, but let's put this up here anyway. And we get our red-green. Okay, so this is C, okay, this is a PNP transistor, oh, got it the first time, okay, so that means that this is C, this is E, and this is B, okay, let's get the red lead here, okay, hardly changes at all. So this is not a very high gain transistor. Thanks for watching.